Islamic culture holds many cultures within it. You have many ethnic, different ethnic groups, different languages, different you know, traditions within the tradition, in a way. So the Islamic world is itself a symbol of unity that holds diversity. And within the art itself, although, although there is a general you know, language that we recognize as Islamic art, we recognize different styles, different arts that stand out, you know, from Iranian art to Spanish art, different periods, regions, etc. But this so-called Islamic art, you know, when you get close to the objects, very often you find that these objects themselves express these diversities and they also are themselves symbols of bridges and bridging. So you get close to, you know, let's say, a carpet, and you find that although it was used in a Jewish temple, it has Islamic arabesques within it. Because people live together, and they interact, and bridging within the social fabric is a constant thing. That's the nature of life.